Hello, everyone. It is Thursday morning, and it is New Year's Eve, and I want to wish everyone a happy new year. Looking forward to a new year, aren't you? And so, well, we are uh, going, this is the last devotion of the year, and uh, of course, we are. We have been in Proverbs. Proverbs 31 is where we're at, and probably the most famous proverb because of the content of it, uh, the virtuous woman. And so, but we're not necessarily going to talk about that as we are, though, about family. And the Bible says in Proverbs 31 and in verse number 11, the heart of her husband doth safely trust in her so that he shall have no need of spoil. Well, believe it or not, family is is, uh, what we're talking about today. Here we find a woman who is married. She has children and and, uh, she has a husband. And the Bible describes something about her husband that ought to be in every marriage. And that is this, trust. The Bible says that he trusts her. He trusts her explicitly. He doesn't doubt. There's no, there's no uh, mistrust there at all in the relationship. And I tell you, marriages today, it's hard to make it go. It's hard to have a successful marriage without trust. If you're always wondering, if you're always doubting what your spouse is up to, or if you don't trust what they say or what they do, it really makes it hard to have the marriage that God would have for you. But aren't you thankful for those of you that are married? Aren't you thankful that you don't have to doubt whether or not your spouse is uh, telling the truth or not telling the truth? That you don't have to worry about what they're doing? Boy, what a blessing that is. So I challenge you and I encourage you today, especially as we end this this year and start a new year. You know, one of the goals should be this, help us to be better uh, people when it comes to our marriage, a better husband, a better wife, and may trust dominate the relationship. May you trust the Lord and may you trust each other. Let us pray. Father, bless us today. And Lord, may, as we head into the new year, our marriages be stronger. And Lord, may your will be done, I ask in Jesus' name. Amen. God bless you. And I pray, may your marriage be sweet.